because uh, Ghana has been producing oil for the past 10 years. Uh, the revenues that have been coming from there, we take the view that it's important that we fund our development first before we then focus on renewable energy sources. Uh, obviously, if you look at our energy mix, we have some 72% uh, thermal, which is by itself powered by some 95% on gas. And we have some 30% hydro, and we have renewable sources, some 0.82%. We're looking to scale that up to some 10% by 2020. But obviously, because of our peculiar needs as a developing country, uh, citizens' expectation will be that the country funds its development because uh, pressure the thought that uh, you see Ghana building uh, power charging stations across the highways that themselves do not exist, as opposed to building schools, as opposed to building hospitals, as opposed to building infrastructure. So what our strategy is and has been is to channel investment in our oil space, first to fund our development, and subsequently when we have enough of the resource, then channel the rest into building new uh, energy sources that we commit to because of the global situation that we all find ourselves in. Honourable Minister, I imagine that in that context, the role of local content is really important. Perhaps you can say a few words about um, what policies you put in place to develop local content in oil and gas. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Uh, local content and localization is very important to us as well. And, and so we have the local content policy uh, regulations that the Petroleum Commission of Ghana, uh, headed by uh, Ben Fibo here, is championing. Our intention is to ensure that within the next five to ten years, Ghanaian participation in our oil and gas space, which we believe will still be in demand going forward, regardless of the talk that we all hear about the need for us to transition. That recognition is there, but then we still believe strongly that oil and gas, and particularly gas, because it's a cleaner floor, and because the need to move away from coal and other sources, and the need for us to have some energy source that will enable us to power our base loads, gas will still be a critical factor going forward. And so we intend to spend more of our resources in exploring our gas, so that we can use that to fund our development, as I indicated earlier. But we think that's important for the locals. Only a short while ago, we were in a meeting with uh, Sloan Beje, and we drummed it home quite strongly to them, the need for them to ensure that Ghanaian participation in the space is increased, enhanced, and that's exactly what we're working on to achieve.